Let's go to diagnosis according to Sanjiao theory. The topic is damp heat in upper jaw. Damp heat in the upper jaw is an early stage of a damp heat invasion. The lung and the skin are affected. The etiology is exposure to damp heat pathogenic qi. Fever that is highest in the afternoon is one of the symptoms and signs. There's also nausea, aversion to cold, heavy and aching arms and legs, poor appetite, abdominal bloating, heavy headache, chest oppression, lack of sweating or sticky sweat, fatigue, diarrhea or constipation, greasy yellow tongue coating, and the pulse will be rapid and slippery. The key symptoms here are heavy headache, heaviness in the limbs, rapid and slippery pulse. The treatment principle for this is expel and drain damp heat and activate Wei Qi. The acupuncture points to choose from are Do 14, Li4, Li11, Lung 7, Spleen 3, Spleen 9, Ren 12, and Pericardium 6. Needling technique to, is draining. Explanation for the points is Do 14 drains heat and activates Wei Qi. Li4 and Lung 7 activate Wei Qi and expel pathogenic Qi. Li11 expels pathogenic Qi and drains damp heat. Spleen 3 and Spleen 9 drain damp heat. REN12 and pericardium 6 regulate the qi mechanism in the middle and upper jaw. For relevant advice, when there is an invasion of damp heat, the person should avoid consuming food and beverages that create damp heat. An invasion of damp heat can be caused by no previous pattern, but it can result in middle jaw heat, lower jaw heat, pericardium heat, and spleen qi deficiency. Thank you so much for your attention.